All right, I just noticed uh, from one of the comments. Um, I heard totally forgot about part zero, so I just kind of did something up for you guys. Uh, okay, so part zero <laughs> uh, deals with power supply, and this is an absolute must. Um, it won't work any other way. I should have made this the first video, but I think I put it in there because I was making a second video, and then I kind of like, Named that part one. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, here's part zero. Um, and we're not going to look at the screen. We're actually going get, to get out and do something. So I'm calling field trip. Let's go to the bench. Twenty-four volts, five amps. Uh, this is a one twenty or a two twenty. Um, so that being said, let's move to that. And this guy here. With my shaky video, I don't know if you can see in there, but there's a little switch in there. So make sure that switch is uh, at your your wall power. So my wall power is 120 volts. So make sure that's on your your wall power, whatever you're putting into it. And here we have line in. Hotline, neutral, ground. So that's for this guy. Um, depending on if you have the same power supply as this one here, that should help you out that way. Um, for those of you that are new to this. Um, okay, so common, common, those are grounds. And this is a uh, voltage. These are all DC here because it switches it from AC over here to DC. And these guys here are positive 24 volts out. So they give you two terminals and then two terminals for ground. So your voltage adjust is over here. I always check my voltage adjusts after, uh, well, before, just to make sure that I'm, my giant head's in the way of the light. Anyway, <laughs> um, so that being said, let's move to the Envium. So you see this wire that's all twisted up. That's called twisted pairs. Um, there is an actual spec to this. Uh, 12, 12 turns per inch or something like that. I forget. Um, but anyway, the whole deal behind this is to cancel out uh, uh, waves, I guess, or frequency, frequency of the uh, DC voltage going through it. All right, so we follow that in. This is all disconnected. I should mention that right now. Um, so just be aware. Keep this down and be aware that this is going to shock you. Uh, whether it be 220 or 120, this will shock you. Um, and I'm pretty sure this will shock you too, but your fingers have to be wet for the DC voltage. Anyway, um, okay, so your, uh, I'm going to shake your video again. Your leads will come in here, right here, positive. So your V plus 24 volts right here, or 32 volts or whatever you're running, and your voltage negative on this side. And that's about it. So part zero is consistent with power supply because here's the reason why I'm doing part zero as a power supply. Power supply is a huge thing with this thing. It doesn't like 0.7 amps. It doesn't like 0.9 amps. It wants one amp or more. So and that being said, let's uh, just cut out and I'm going to show you how to tell if it's on or not. And this is a huge part of this and really sorry I should have put this in there a long time ago, but I think I lost the footage in, um, in the pile of footage because this is a lot of footage. Because um, I say I'm a lot, but anyway, <laughs> it's all good. Give me a second there and we'll be right back. All right, we're back. So... If you'll notice, my LED here, I'm going to not try and stick my, my poker there in there. Um, my LED is on for the power supply. And I'm going to follow this wire out. Now, if you look inside or between this guy here, where is my camera? Here it is. If you look down in there, you'll see a little red hue or a light. That's the uh, red LED for the power. 
and that's what you want. Um, usually they'd be green, but I guess in, for some reason they decided to go red. Anyway, regardless, this is how you, you uh, know it's on and it's good. Okay, that's it for uh, the top secret uh, part zero. And um, happy holidays, everyone. And hope that helps. And we'll see you in the next one. Should be calibration coming up soon. Uh, I'm going to put up another video up there of something else. Uh, just some laser stuff. Pretty cool. Anyway, hopefully you find it cool too. Adios for now.